G'day guys, here we are Thursday. We're here for Charlie's fitting session. We're here at Golf Gurus at Aspley, which is on Gimby Road. That's Aspley, Charlie. <laughs> uh, we're gonna go inside, we're gonna meet Dan. He's gonna do our fitting session with Charlie. Here's Dan. What's up, boys? Here we go. Fan of the show. Here we go. G'day guys, we're here at the Golf Gurus Aspley, and I've uh, got Dan here today. He's gonna explain a few things about Mizuno and the MP25 25. That, I, that I just used in the MP25. So right, guys, look, the important thing about getting fitted is not about getting the right length, it's about getting the right shaft. There's different swings. What was your clubhead speed? Uh, for the six iron, I think it was 87. Okay, so yeah, 87, 87 miles an hour, so we've gone with a very strong shaft, which is a Project X. Yep. So myself, use me as an example, my clubhead speed's about 70 miles an hour. Yep. So I use a 95 gram shaft. So what that does, it gives me a higher launch. Yep. Okay, more control, actually more distance. So the, the benefit with getting fitted and the real fitting is to get the right shaft. If you do not get the right shaft, there's no sense buying a set of golf clubs. No, that's a big that's a big reason why I wanted to come here. Absolutely. And especially to Mizuno yep. uh, fitting center. Yep. Yeah, it's important. So. so you know everyone's every swing's different, that's why there's different shafts. So you got big hitters, they use real strong shafts, they want they you create loft. Yep. All right, I don't. I need something that helps me get it in the air. So I need a light shaft, low kick point. You big boys are hit it hard. You need a shaft that's strong. Yep. That's low speed. So where would you say the, the kick point is in that? Sorry. That's a mid kick point. That's a mid kick yep. point. When you talk about kick points and shaft, a lot of people think it's way up here to that. It's only about, it's like a half inch. All right. right. So yep. kick point, a low kick point's here. The other one's here. It's not much different. It's, it's just minimal. Correct, but it will affect the ball flight. Yeah. So a head like that is designed for someone who hits it hard, who creates loft, who hits it hard. Yep. So what happens there, you get them a shaft that will keep it damp, you know, keep it mid, mid flight, because you're creating loft. You don't want to have a shaft. If you were using my shaft that I use, the 95 gram low kick point, you would just balloon it. Yeah. Okay, because yeah. you're stronger, but I need help with that. So that's the benefit of getting the right shaft. Yep. No, I've, I've seen that firsthand. I had a set of AP ones yep. with a 95. I think they were done with gold. Or, Correct. And they had 95s, and when I yep. just hit it, it's very much higher than what, yeah. I, what I hit. It's not bad to hit it high as long as it's going long. All yeah. right. So when you say high, you, you don't want it doing this and dropping. You want it where it's doing that. That's why with drivers now, you look at drivers, not to go to drivers, is that some of your best players in the world are using 11, 12 degree lofts, but with a good shaft, yeah. with a yeah. real good shaft. So you don't want to have 11, 12 degree loft with a real whippy shaft, it's just gonna go straight in the air. So yep. it launches hard. You can get something to launch hard, you have more control. Yep. Much more control. Oh, great. Yeah. Thanks for that, I appreciate it. Great that. choice, that's yeah. a record. I love it, I love it. Mizuno is the gear, what, what is it? No excuses. No excuses. No, no excuses. excuses. <laughs> no excuses. No excuses. And, and you, you do believe on the record that's a kangaroo? That's yeah. a kangaroo. There we go, that's a kangaroo. It's a kangaroo. It's a fucking kangaroo. There you go, all right. Okay. Cool. Great.